trap, he trash money. So today I'm coming to you with a new wig review and it is about the unit that is on top of my head right now and might I say it's a look. So this wig is from maingang.com and it is from a hair company called Hera Remy. That's I think that's how you say it. This wig is in the style Ariel. So I have seen this wig floating around YouTube for a minute, but of course, when I tried to go buy it, it was sold out. So I, you know, signed up for the notifications because I really wanted this wig. I've been trying to find a deep wave synthetic wig <laughs> for the longest time, and finally, they restocked it, so I was able to buy it. I got it in the color 1B. Um, originally, I was going to get one, but I decided just to go with 1B, um, just so it would look more natural. The construction of this wig, as you saw in the customization part, is it is actually not a lace front wig. It did come with baby hairs at the front, so I didn't have to make them myself. I just used the ones that they gave me, and I don't think I did. I'm getting, a, I'm getting better at this, y'all. Like, well, you see, here's my natural hair, but <laughs> like... I'm getting like a wee bit better at laying down the baby hairs and this wig was really like easy to customize also like I didn't really have to do much to it as you saw I plucked it a little bit and then I stopped because I felt like it was just kind of unnecessary and I put powder on the part just to make it blend with my scalp and I laid down the baby hairs and then I also used a curling wand to kind of flatten the top because the top was looking a little bit bulky but um other than that I didn't really have to do much to this wig it was pretty pretty easy although it's not a lace front wig it does come with two combs at the part like one is right one right here and one right there and it also has a comb in the back it also has adjustable straps and I would say that this wig is big head friendly like I have a huge head so <laughs> And I don't feel like this wig is um, crushing my head, you know, to the skull. This wig is long as hell. Like, it might be low-key too long for me. And, you know, that's saying something because I love long hair. It, like, goes past my butt. Like, it stops at, like, the middle of my thigh. It's not too thick and it's not too thin. The density, I would say, is just right. Um... It does not feel heavy on my head at all. It's just long. <laughs> like, literally, it's just freaking long. It's like a cute, like, picture wig, you know? Where it is to be cute, not practical kind of wig. <laughs> I really do love this wig, and it was affordable. It was only $25. That's also key. I should probably put that at the beginning. But it was only $25, and with shipping, it came out to be, like, $31-something. So it was a, an affordable wig. Um, 
especially because it, you know it's really soft um for a synthetic hair wig it feels really soft very <laughs> realistic actually um and it doesn't tangle too bad like it doesn't tangle as bad as you would think it would for a long wavy wig well now it's no <laughs> but it doesn't tangle that bad um it sheds a little bit but not too much from what i can see um so the shedding is pretty minimal this wig is also you can also use heat on this wig as you saw i did earlier and um, you can use heat up to 360 degrees i want to say yes this wig is great. This wig is great for beginners also because you don't have to do so much customization to it and also because it's so affordable. Um, so I would definitely recommend this wig um, to you guys. This is a 5 out of 5. I love this wig. I don't have any complaints about it. It is the move. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick wig review and I will see you in the next video. Bye!